So this AI prompting hack is now available inside Claude. And guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can access this for free so you can generate better outputs using Claude. So if you're new to the channel, my name is Ryan with AI Insider Tips, and my mission here is to help you navigate the overwhelming world of artificial intelligence. So if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and let's dive back into this AI prompting hack. So this AI prompting hack now available inside Claude is called AI PRM as you'll see up here. And if you've never heard of AI PRM, this is a free Chrome extension that you can install right now in your Chrome browser. And I'll leave a link to this and everything else that I mentioned in the video description below. But what AI PRM is, is it's essentially an extension that curates hundreds of these different prompt templates for various use cases. So if I come back after installing the Chrome extension here, if you come back to Claude and refresh the page, your interface should now look like this. And by all these different use cases, what I mean is just read some of these boxes here, right? So SEO optimized article, FAQs, outrank article, keyword strategy. Uh, you can generate image prompts for Flux One or Mid Journey, right? There's all these different use cases that you can do in a curated prompt versus me going down into the search bar down here and saying like, write me a blog post about SEO, generate me an image prompt uh, for an image of a dog, right? There's just a lot more parameters and details in these curated prompts versus me trying to do it myself, which is what most people do when they're new to AI. Uh, so for example, let's say I wanna do something with the keyword strategy. I'm just gonna use this as an example. This box will pop up down here. As you'll see, it says keyword strategy. And so it's asking me to give my keywords. This would be like a base keyword. So if I wanna write, you know, let's say I wanna write topics about SEO, uh, for my base keyword, I would probably do something like, let's do best SEO tools. And here you'll see I have Claude 3.5 Sonnet. I would keep that checked. Uh, what's cool about this is it also gives you the option to integrate a Claude project. And if you're unfamiliar with Claude projects, I'll leave that tutorial in the description below. This is for Claude Pro users only, and that does cost $20 a month. Uh, but to use AI PRM and to use the general version of Claude is 100% for free. So I'm actually going to integrate my Ryan uh, AI agent so this will sound more like me. Um, and then for subcategories, just leave it at seven and then go ahead and hit the enter button and let's see what this comes up with. All right, so as you'll see here, this generated me a table and I know this is basic, but what's cool is it already had that formatting in place along with other parameters. Um, so it gave me some keyword clusters, some keyword ideas, the search intent, even gave me a title idea, gives you the meta description based on this curated prompt. Um, and so from here, you could plug this in and then start generating articles one by one using Claude as well. So that was just a really quick example of showing you what AI PRM can do. Now let's say, for example, I wanna generate an image prompt. This is another great use case. So I'm gonna click this one right here. And on the bottom it says, generate image prompts for Flux One. And then so now it's gonna basically ask, what type of image are you trying to generate? And so I'm gonna say, uh, let's just do something simple like dogs playing in the snow. And then I'm also gonna integrate my Claude project here so it'll sound more like me. Uh, English default, let's do that. Go ahead and click enter. And what this is going to do is it's going to generate a more advanced image prompt to get a better outputs in terms of AI image generation versus just going into an AI image generator, generator excuse me, and saying, create me an image of dogs playing in the snow. So here it gave me some ideas here. Playful winter pups, snow, snowy husky haven, cozy cabin, urban snow day. Uh, so what I can do is if I wanna go in here, copy this prompt, I can open up an AI image generation tool like ChatGPT. If you're on the plus version, you can use Dali. So I'm gonna do that. Or if you're on Grok, you can use Flux One. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Uh, or you can use the Microsoft Copilot Designer. That's a free version of Dali. Uh, so let's see what this comes up with. So that's not a bad image in my opinion. That was from that more advanced prompt. Uh, so let's see what this came up with. I like that image a lot from Flux One. So in Grok, you can generate images with Flux One. You have to be a member. I think it costs $8 a month to use this. But regardless, that's what the power of something like this can do inside Claude versus just going in here and trying to figure it out yourself. AI PRM now gives you the ability with curated prompt templates to make this process a lot easier. So I'm gonna show you one more quick example, and this is going to be writing an article using a prompt from AIPRM. So right here, this is a good one that I found 
fully SEO optimized article, including FAQs by Muhammad Tala. So I'm going to go ahead and click this. Looks like it was updated two days ago. And this is going to come down here and ask me for a keyword or a title. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do five SEO tips for your website, some generic title. I'm also going to integrate my Claude project. So it's the outputs sound more like me. I'm going to leave this as default, leave this in English, make sure you have Claude 3.5 Sonnet checked. And I'm going to go ahead and click enter. And what this is going to do is it's going to generate an outline towards the beginning, or it should generate an outline towards the beginning. And then based on that outline, it'll actually generate a full length SEO optimized blog post. So I'm going to wait and then come back after this output is complete. All right, and here's the output that I got from that AI PRM curated prompt. And you'll see here, it's actually still writing. So this did take about 30 to 60 seconds, I would say, for this to be fully generated. Um, but what I like, again, is up here, it has this table of the outline. So headings, subheadings, um, and then it gives you a little outline here, and then it actually writes the post based on that outline. So five proven tips to boost your website's rankings in 2024. It, it made that more SEO optimized than what I gave it in the prompt. Uh, we got an introduction. We got, you know, the optimize your content tip one. Uh, so tip two, improve your site speed. Tip three, increase UX. Uh, tip four, build quality backlinks. Tip five, leverage local SEO. So all those make sense, right? So the output here from a high level looks good enough in my opinion. Now you wouldn't wanna come in here and just copy and paste this whole thing, paste it on your website and hit publish. You'd wanna humanize it a little more with images, internal links, outbound links, uh, and all the other SEO best practices that you would add to an article like this. So long story short guys, the reason this is so important of using a prompt like this inside AI PRM, if I click the back button, is instead I would have to come down to this search bar and say something like, write me an SEO optimized blog post based on this title, include all these different parameters, make sure you include a table of the outline and all these different things you have to remember in your head as you're trying to craft this perfect prompt, where instead of doing that, you can just install the AI PRM extension, click whatever one option here that you like from the menu, and then just start plugging away by giving it a keyword or a title. Now I mentioned this before earlier in the video, but AI PRM also has an extension for ChatGPT and that's how they became popular. As you'll see here, they have over 2 million users that have used this with ChatGPT. So if you want to explore AI PRM with ChatGPT, you can definitely do that as well. But that's all for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed this AI prompting hack that you can now use inside Claude, which is called AI PRM. So again, this is Ryan with AI Insider Tips. Be sure to subscribe like this video if you found value, dislike if you didn't find value, but most importantly, leave me a comment below. I want to know if you guys have used AI PRM before in the past. Are there any other prompting hacks or tips that you want to share with me? I really enjoy hearing what you guys have to say in the comments. So I hope you all have a great day.